guys! We are here for another Dokkan battle video. So, we are going to talk about Global Dokkan. Global Dokkan got their New Year's celebration info here. Um, and it's pretty good. I mean, we, we got one of the main things we wanted to see. Um, which, of course, is Gogeta and Broly are coming to Global Easing at the same time. Um... So, that means you know, when they end up being mid, we could just say, oh, well, global same time release. It's always a fumble, right? <laughs> no. <laughs> well, maybe. <laughs> All right. Um. So, global gets the same sort of like, you know, happy holidays, happy new year kind of like image and thing that JP got. Now, <clears throat> we look at this and it's like, at most people, I actually have seen some orange piccolo haters pop up now. Um, and I, I, honestly, for this character, I do feel like it's just blind, like, hate, like, I, um, I, I mean, I want to choose my words carefully here, but I mean, Orange Piccolo is so clearly the best tune in the game, just because of how strong his transformation is, that I, I just feel like if you're not putting him at number one, like, w you just don't like Piccolo? Like, I don't, I, I don't, it, it's just, there's, I don't see any criteria where a character attacks 20 consecutive times could do good damage and then he can't take damage while doing it like it's just it, like he's a, an offensive god and a defensive god right senzu heal all the good stuff orange piccolo i think is a complete w in every way besides his transformation animation being a little bit wonky i think they could have made that look uh, better for sure uh orange piccolo is a huge w I, i'm very satisfied now, Beast Gohan, we know, I mean, he's the biggest fumble of all time in Dokkan history. Um, he should be the most, he is, you know, one of the most anticipated characters ever. Um, it's uh, pretty crazy the way they handled him. Now, I do think we're going to now enter into Beast Gohan Watch. So, it's like, you, you know, you're going to see me and other YouTubers. All right, we're leading up to Golden Week 2023. Um, is it Beast Gohan? What do you guys think? You know, and then Tanabata. Oh, Beast Gohan. I, I think the likely landing spot, the next Beast Gohan card we could get, probably would be ninth anniversary. So when Gogeta and Broly dropped, remember, they dropped at the end of 2018. That was leading into the four-year anniversary, which is LR Super Saiyan 4 Goku and LR Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta, right? And then remember, the following year's anniversary was uh, LR Blue Gogeta and Blue Vegito. So, if we follow that same time frame, um, Gohan, right, comes out now. We're going to go into the 8th anniversary. I think ninth anniversary Beast Gohan. Very decent shot of that, right? Um, so, let's see. So, they released my profile uh, feature that allows you to display titles. They should buff titles, make them more meaningful. And then set your power level. Of course, that's really awesome. I love the power level thing. Um, more quest stages have been really good. I think they've handled that well. And then burst mode, you global guys have only gotten the first burst mode so far, which wasn't really that fun. I think the second burst mode was pretty fun. I really liked that. Um, so we had the, uh, cooler movie worldwide Dallas celebration. And then of course, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Dragon Ball super superhero celebration was really good. Really good. Um, well, the, 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 the celebration is actually super good. It's just, yeah. Uh, Beast Gohan. Um, Dokkan achieved a lot in 2022. There's going to be a Dokkan fest and discount stuff like that. Yeah, the New Year's step up is terrible. Um, Dokkan, they didn't adapt to the own sort of like landscape they created, right? Where with 200% leader skills, they did a soft reset, I've been calling it. Where, you know, all the previous, like 2021 and beyond characters really are not that impressive. For the most, 99% of them are not that impressive. There's options, Tech Ultimate Gohan... AGL PyCon, right? Like, uh, Tech Kefla is usable, right? Like, there's scattered releases that, that are helpful, sure. But for the most part, you just want to be using 2022 characters right now. So the New Year's step up is just not it. Um, So we have a login bonus. I love Pan in the little schoolgirl outfit right there. Uh, So there's going to be some stones, meats, uh, keys. um, And then this uh monster carrot support item seems pretty good. Changes all key spheres into carrots. And then you get 15 defense per key sphere attain. I'm going to do a video on this um, probably uh, tonight. Um, I, like, there's certain characters I think this would just be insane on. So, like, any character that could guard. So, like, LR Vegeta and Trunks, Tech Ultimate Gohan, right? Maybe at the start of the fight, even, like, you know, LR Ultimate Gohan or Orange Pickle or something like that. Any character that has damage reduction or guard inherently built in they're going to be crazy with this, right? Like, like I don't know. Like, if I went into Cell Max, well, you can only use the Senzu in there, but if I went into Cell Max and gave, like, Carnival Goku this, 
like how how well would he then tank Cell Max a super attack, right? Like something like that. I'd be very interested to see. Uh, since 2023 is the year of the rabbit, Monster Carrot uh, has shown up as a support item. I do like that they're still doing support items. Up to 54 stones can be obtained during this period. Okay, good luck for those still trying to summon for Piccolo or Gohan. Right, again, if you're... Uh, this is like a global-centric video we're making here. Um, uh, global players, I don't anticipate... So oh my god, this can't miss character just dropped out of nowhere. Oh my god, I don't expect... I mean... I think LR Golden Freeze should be coming in a couple of weeks, probably, for Global. Um, he's just going to swap and take what would have been Fusion's Amasu spot at the end of January. Um, and then I think maybe there will be a Global first in February with the LR God Goku EZA, but we will see, right? Um, okay, so there's a bunch of missions, uh, and you can get a bunch of just normal stuff in here, okay? Including the Jackie Chun statues, that's a lot of Zenny, okay? Uh, rank growth packs will be redesigned. Oh, another JP shaft. What a shock. It's going to be, so they're going to update this SSR force. This is a good idea. I just wish they'd bring that shit to JP. Yeah. Okay. So, I mean, this, this could be good for newer players. I mean, the, the thought here, I guess, is that this could be good for newer players. Um, I, again, just wish they'd bring these to JP, but that, that could be cool. Um, another global advantage over JP right there. Um, so here we have the actual celebration for, let's, let's, what, what is this? Okay, so we got the, the extra boosts. Yeah, okay, so, wait, is Global just getting this? Yeah, they are. Okay, JP has had this for a while, this sort of, like, um, the one day of the week you get the five boosts instead, which, which is helpful. Um, I certainly get good value out of that, I think, with link leveling, so that's, that's good. Uh, oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, don't summon. Just, just don't, just don't. Look at this, look at this image. The best character on here is Majin Vegeta. Uh, well... Hmm, actually... Would I put Majin Vegeta above Ginyu now? Probably not. I, Ginyu is the best character, but Majin Vegeta is probably... Uh, maybe? I, I don't know. I, Ma, as, as the time goes on, and, like, you know, the Ginyu Force sort of gets power crept, Majin Vegeta still looks good with Vegeta and Trunks. I don't know. It's, it's between these two, but a lot of these characters... I mean, they're still good, but, like, you know, they're not what they were... They can get you the heal, right? Like, you are nothing, you're nothing, you're nothing. These two are okay, right? Like, it's just not worth it, man. All right, let's see what we got. So, um, Festival Step Up Summon, you're guaranteed to recruit eight. Well, I mean, we could put, quote. can we put quotations on this? We got the quotations right here. Can we put them on powerful for me, please? Okay. A <laughs> powerful character, yeah. Okay, so we have login, missions, the New Year's step up, I definitely skip it. Uh, you're way better off, even though the, the Gohan and Piccolo banners are bad, you're probably way better off summoning for those, honestly. Um, stones, sure, stone sales. Uh, Baba points off, training, success rates. Uh, new stage of extreme Super Battle Road is coming up. Uh, what is this? This is going to be Vegeta Family, correct? Uh, Vegeta Family is a tough stage. Um, Vegeta and Trunks obviously are really good in there, but they, they do hit very hard in that stage. Uh, Battlefield as well. Uh, oh, that's tonight. That's, that's in two hours. Okay. Um, we have, uh, all Dokkan events will be up, which is good. All EZAs will be up. That's also good. Uh, we have the Gogeta and Broly EZA. That's definitely super good here. Um, now these two do have, you know, what I call kind of like the skeleton of a good kit. Well, I would more so say Gogeta here does with his super effective against all types, his dodge, his guaranteed crit and his dodge, right? Broly, I, they got to give Broly a lot, man, in order to make him super. They do. They got to really give Broly a lot. I, I just don't, I don't know. We'll, we'll see what these characters are going to look like. I think they, they should be fairly competent no matter what, right? Like, Gogeta is going to really help. He's on a lot of bad teams, right, that need help. Actually, so is Broly, right? Like, Exploding Rage. Yeah, Exploding Rage, Miraculous Awakening. Broly's on a lot of teams that I, I do want, you know, more options added to. Full power as well. Okay, not bad for Broly there. Yeah, they're both characters that are going to buff bad teams, which I like quite a bit. Um, That's on the fifth, okay. Uh, Easy Challenge Pack. These are all just... Yeah, this is all just... Uh, nothing. Oh, Global never got these guys, huh? Yeah, okay. Um, 
So these are sub EZAs. Uh, I mean, I have never really ended up using these guys at all. Uh, LR Golden Freeze is probably going to come out with them because, I mean, we could take a look right here, right? Uh, the problem with these Vegetas is that they, they category restricted them. This guy needs to be used with physical units. Um, I think he could be decent in Battlefield, but that's probably it. Um, then we have this Vegeta. You have to use him on a Realm of God team, and he's okay. Um, and then this blue Vegeta, you have to use him on a Master Evolution team, and he's okay. Um, but the, none of the three are overly um, impressive. But that means Golden Freeze is probably going to come out with them, which 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 is anticipated. I, I would say it's expected. We were expecting Golden Freeze to come out this year for sure. Or uh, this month, excuse me. Uh, then we got some weekend summons. Fine. You know, free characters for people. Bunch of EZAs return. Oh, here's the rank growth pack on the 11th. Oh, the physical Trunks and Goten are going to be in there, huh? Wait, whoops. No, go back. Uh, the physical Trunks and Goten are going to be in there. Okay. Uh, oh! Area 29. That's good. Um, Area 29 has a really good... Um, Link level stage and incredible gem grinding spot. What is it? I think it's area 29.3 um, is really good for incredible gems and auto. Link levels, auto, incredible gems. You get all of it. Bam. It's really good. That's on the 13th. Okay, that's that's a W. Um, JP has also got an area 30 as well, which has another uh, incredible gem like auto stage. That's really good. So... There we go. There is the global New Year celebration info. Seems good. I do expect more stuff is going to come uh, from the superhero celebration. I don't think the New Year celebration is going to be updated like this is it. But the superhero celebration, we know for sure that this guy is at least going to EZA. Maybe we could see the Gamma's Awaken. Maybe AGL, LR Gohan, and in LR Cell could EZA also. There's possibilities there. So let me know what you guys think of the global celebration info. Thanks guys for watching, and I'll catch you all next time.